All right, I'm gonna redo my last video. It didn't turn out too well. Okay, Google to predict when you die. Yes, they're, they're doing the whole machine thing as to when a patient can die. Okay, here, here's a quick article before the, my computer goes nuts. Um, yeah, Google is training machines to predict when a patient will die. So yeah, I told you how this works, you know. Once they have your DNA, your frequency, they uh, hone in and they track and trace you and they have you uploaded to their AI system. So here's your uh, future gang stalkers. They groom them. Um, President orders Pentagon to create Space Force branch of military. Let's see what this is. I don't know. Uh... Oh, I, hey, you know what? I didn't know we had a National Space Council. What is that, fucking NASA? All right, here. President Donald Trump is announcing that he is directing the Pentagon to create the Space Force as an independent service, service branch. Trump said money that we're all going to have the Space Force. The what? Which he deemed a separate but equal branch of the military. Oh, you mean Black Ops? Trump says the United States will be the leader by far in space to look and looks to revive the nation's uh, flagging space program. <laughs> People, they already are out there. Already. They've been doing this shit since the 1930s. All right, the president frames space as a national security issue. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. You ready? You ready? Reagan said there was a threat out in space, so we need national security. So it's a lockdown on the planet. Even more of a lockdown. Oh yeah, these motherfuckers are pieces of shit, man. Trump also vowed to, to soon return the U.S. to the moon and reach Mars. They're already there, people. They're already there. It's been going on for thousands of years. The moon is artificial. And they've already got people on Mars. That's the breakaway civilization that you lead. Don't let them fool you. Trump was joined by Vice President Mike Pence, NASA Administrator Jim uh, Bridstein, former astronaut Buzz, and members of his space council. Woo, I told you they're getting you prepped, man. They're getting ready, you ready prepped for the second cup. Mm-hmm. All right, what else we got going on here? Okay, so um, I want to just bring this up. Father's Day. Here's an ad uh, title. Bill Clinton, Bill Clinton's son, calls for dad to take paternity test. Okay, so I want to get the date on this. I want to get a date. Okay, 2018. So we're on the right timeline. Now... Infowars went to um, this this auditorium speech where Bill Clinton showed up, and they were chanting, you know, uh, "Hey, you need to uh, do a paternity." You know, what about Danny? Justice for Danny. You know, I thought this kid passed away. I thought he passed away. I don't know. Did he? Or didn't he? I don't know. You tell me. I thought he committed suicide. I don't know. You know, I have no clue. Um, hmm. Danny Williams still wants to have a relationship with the man he calls his dad. Still wants. Present tense. Um, okay. Interesting. I'm going to just bring that out for observation. And let's go back to Drudge Report. 
Um, I want to bring up the San Francisco um, homeless problem. I believe that a lot of these homeless people are being paid $45 an hour. They're gang stalkers. Okay. Okay. Heroin isn't cheap. Okay. It's all funded by the CIA. And who is the CIA? Who's behind all that? George Soros and the elite. Your knights, uh, your Swiss Templars. The enemy within is the Swiss Templars. These guys. Okay, they have endless amounts of money to get people, paid actors, out on the street to cause havoc. To get the average citizen to leave San Francisco. Why? Because the elite want the city. How do you get people to leave a city? You terrorize them, right? It's no different than... It's war. The elite have declared war on you. You don't even realize it. They want the city so they can restructure it the way they want. They could put their 5G uh, Lennar uh, expensive homes, which run about $400,000 a, um, a pop. <clears throat> See what they're doing? The haves and the have-nots. And they're using these people, the gang stalkers, to make you leave. They're doing it on purpose. Now, yes, there are people who are um, genuinely, you know, homeless. Uh, yes. But, you know, I would say in general, you know, these people are paid $45 an hour, which is military grade pay, which runs between sixty and $89,000 a year. These people are paid with gift cards and actual cash. Okay. Okay. And that's the way it is, man. I've seen these tents that these uh, homeless people live in. And let me tell you, these tents, because I, I know outdoor stuff, equipment, it ain't cheap. You know, plus look at how they're dressed. That's not, ex not you know. It's no different than when the migrants came over in the United Kingdom. Look how they're dressed. Okay. You know, they got shoes on their feet and everything. Um, what else we got going on here? Um, White House aims to reduce satellite clutter in space. Okay, so first we're worried about global warming and now we're worried about space. So I'm telling you, they're prepping you. They're prepping you for their uh, little uh, main event, I believe. Reducing satellite clutter. Oh, and suddenly you're all, all worried about fucking satellites in the sky, huh? Yeah, right. That's a little bullshit. Lying, lying, lying. They're all liars. What else we got here in Lizard News? Oh, defiant Eminem keeps gunshot effects, tells the fans easily who are easily frightened shouldn't be here. Oh, this should be interesting. Hmm. All right, let's see what we got here. Get rid of this advertising. Okay. Eminem is not sorry. Part 313. Well, there's your Freemasonry. 33. Um, after more than 20 years of shocking people, generally ignoring the backlash, you didn't really think Eminem was going to go back down. Okay, let's see.
Okay, if you are easily frightened by loud noises or offended by explicit lyrics, you shouldn't be here. Well, okay, well. In a way, he's kind of, you know, warning y'all. But he also knows about the, uh, the fancy technology that's out there that can scare you. If you're not a, you, used to it. Like the ELF and the microwave technology and the synthetic telepathy and the voice of God technology that will, you know, shock your system, your shock and awe, your chakra, your chakra system. Right, Ra? Huh? All right. Um... Okay, less than a year after Vegas and Eminem thinks it's a good idea to blast gunshot SFX on stage at a music festival. Well, don't go to these shows, people. Don't pay this man. I wouldn't. I don't even, I don't know. I don't go. I stopped going to rock concerts. Last the rock concert I went to was Ozzy. Let's see, it was Ozzy and um, I forgot who opened. But he was the main show. Yeah. That was the last rock concert I went to was to see Ozzy Osbourne. After that, I kind of like, you know, just moved on. Yeah. Eminem, E, E, 33. The, the E's represent threes, 33. And it's on black and white, which is your night, your, uh, your Masonic stuff. So. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, my, my, my. You know, you're paying. <laughs> what's amazing is that you're paying him to terrorize you. <laughs> That's what's funny. These people are paying money. For you to dodge an air bullet. Um, let's see what else we got here. Massive swarm of bugs invading World Cup. Well, you know what? I've seen some of these drone flies. And they're nasty, man. They do have mosquitoes out there that are nasty. I've experienced them. And, you know, I've seen some drone, drone bugs. Anywhere from dragonflies to fucking bees and... I don't know. I've seen some shit. <sighs> so, I don't know. Let's see. Um, I don't have much time, so I only got a couple minutes left. I've tried to upgrade my minutes on YouTube, but it's a little difficult. Human toe stolen from an exhibition. Well, you know, you know. You've got um, other things on the planet, kids. Oh, here's a good one. DHS is gathering your voice, tattoos, your DNA, and your scars. Why? Well, why not? Because we like to clone. The government's creepy obsession with your face. Yeah, man. This is more of a creepy stalker, stalker fixation. Oh, you don't think? Well. Heart, huh? Heart database. Homeland Advanced Recognition Technology. Wow. Told ya. I ain't fucking around with this, you know, biometrics. I've, you know. I am telling you people, I am not fucking lying to you, the danger that's coming. I'm already in it. And I've already told these lizards to fuck off. So, yeah, you got lizards and greys. You do know that, right? You, you got, and the Templars. You, you got a, we all got a big fucking mess, so. I don't know. Y'all want to fucking go to Starbucks and get your coffee. <laughs> 